Okay, so yesterday our kutatsu futon came. That is this part right here, the fabric part. So that came, our actual kotatsu is not gonna be here probably for a couple more weeks, but I wanted to open this up and just kind of look at it because we're so excited about this. Okay, so we've got the uh, kotatsu futon. Um, this one is uh, actually bigger than it said. It says it's 80 by 80, but I think on the website it said it was 75 by 75. Um, can't read the majority of this, but Kotatsu futon is what we've got, so let's... There's the zipper, there's the zipper. So you can see this one is by... Uh, it's by Room Essence. This is bringing you the toasty, warm, and favorite sweater. Keep you comfort with superior texture. Uh, could probably have used a editor there on the translation, but it's actually fairly thick, which... Uh, was kind of nice, was a little bit more expensive, but a lot of the kotatsu futons that we saw were very thin, and this one was a little thicker. So you've got this really fuzzy, I don't know what to call this. This stuff never stays fuzzy for very long if you wash it too many times. It gets really uh, matted. Um, and then this side is also very warm. Um, it's not something I would wear. It's that blanket when you go over to somebody's house that's not super scratchy, but it's not super soft like this stuff is. It's kind of in between. Very, very warm though. And then this material right here is actually, it's the blanket that's scratchy. It's actually not bad. Uh, there's no scratchiness to it, but I bet if we washed it one too many times, it would start to get uh, pretty bad. So it's pretty thick. I'm actually very impressed on this. And so we've got, I'm gonna turn it upside down so it's correct. Uh, yeah, so you've got the Kotatsu futon. Um, I guess this is just all the numbers and stuff. I can't read any of this. <laughs> well, I can read this. It says uh, Kotatsu, so I'm guessing this means futon, but I'm not sure exactly what it says. So we're gonna be getting the rest of the futon uh, sometime in the next couple weeks, and we'll unpackage and show that off on camera yes yeah, so ko ta tsu and you actually put the u on the end of this one i'm not entirely sure what indicates when you don't have the u but ko ta tsu you keep the u on i'm still learning i'm getting there I'm getting better that I will not approve of because it won't be hot enough. It's been about 
about two weeks since we received our Kutatsu. We've been using it on a regular basis, and I have to say I'm very, very pleased with it. It is plastic, which is one thing that I didn't realize was the case when we first purchased it. Um, but when we put it together, we realized it was plastic. But other than that, like everything else has been great about it. Like the heating unit is great, even though it's 80 degrees outside and we don't want to use it. Um, and I've been very, very pleased with it. So the futon itself is really nice and really, really warm. Uh, very pleased with it. Um, it's a lot heavier than I expected it to be. The heating unit on this table works great. Very pleased about that. It warms up so quickly within like a few seconds. You're just, you don't, you don't want heat anymore. The plastic table, um, at least the tabletop is the only thing that I actually have an issue with, which is not so much that it's plastic. It just, when you touch it, I actually can't see, tell if you can see it on the camera or not, but any oil you have on your hands just translates right onto the plastic. I have to see if there's a way to actually fix that because it's actually kind of annoying. But other than that, this table has been absolutely positively great. It's too hot to really be using this right now, but the temperature has been going up and down for like a couple weeks now. So it's probably going to cool down again. Um, we use it on a regular basis. I've got my laptop out here right now, but we use it to eat on. Uh, it's really easy to clean. You just use a cloth, wipe everything down. I work out here. Um, my cat sleeps on the futon, even though right now she's not really interested in sleeping out here. Um, where are you doing? She just got done eating. <laughs> um, so it's been, it's become very, very useful. The only thing is right now, we don't actually have any cushions for our um, kotatsu. So we need to pick up some chairs. One of the biggest issues with not having cushions, we've just like sitting on the floor is just way too hard. Like it's hard on the knees. It's hard on everything because we've got hardwood. And then um, we do have some small cushions that we have for our stools that we've been using to sit on, but they're really meant for the stools. So they're not, they don't hold shape very well, honestly. So we do need to get some cushions for the, um, for the Kotatsu, we thought about getting those chairs that actually have backs that are on the floor, but I don't know where to purchase those in the States. So cushions are probably going to be what we need, though there are some great options out there and we've been looking for things that we could use for our Kotatsu in the future. But for right now, it's really nice. So I'm very excited. I really, really like it. And um, if you're interested on in buying one, I would seriously suggest doing so. I think it was totally worth the purchase. And I can't wait to use it next winter when it's actually cold. Hopefully, I hope it's cold next winter. Um, we'll see. We'll see what happens. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this uh, little brief vlog about one of our newest pieces of furniture. Thanks for watching.